Now let's do rugby news. The board of the Ghana Rugby Football Union has suspended its chairman and chief executive officer, Herbert Mensah, indefinitely. The board arrived at the decision to suspend the former CEO of Asante Kotoko after a meeting on Tuesday and named Vice President James Nunu as acting president. In a statement that was made available to Joyce Sports, the board described the decision as unfortunate and an enviable task. They said they will convene a special general assembly on June 8th to remove him from office. That was what sources told Joy Sports. On April 22, Joy Sports reported a nine-point petition was filed before the board enumerating a plethora of allegations ranging from unilateralism, conflict of interest to physical abuse of players and demanded that Mr. Mensah be forced to step down as leader of the union within 72 hours. The allegations were echoed by the Greater Accra and Western Region Rugby Union in separate letters to the board on April 29 and 30, respectively. Herbert Mensah was asked by the board to respond to the allegations, but sources say he never replied to the board's request, leading to their decision to suspend him indefinitely. Acting Chairman James Nunu said, Rugby is our love and passion, and rugby must emerge as the winner from this unfortunate moment in the history of Ghana rugby when he was asked to stand in. Rugby Union has achieved memorably under the leadership of Mr. Mensah and a solid platform has been laid to build on that foundation. And that, they thank him very much for his contribution.